What is up, everybody? It is Craig, and I'm back. And I have my last video of the day, as I said, as you go throw some bad some up. So we saw a, what did we say? We saw a fright crate and a couple of miscellaneous. We saw a DVD extravaganza, Blu ray extravaganza, and an amazing pin. If you haven't know what I'm talking about, go back and watch them. And now this is just autographs. And some of these I can hold on to. Like this envelope here, I got this from um, Mint Thick Authentic. I always, like I always screw up the name. But they're an awesome company. Just a couple of 8x10s. Literally, it's been, I've been sitting on this for maybe, maybe four months. So I kind of, you know, kind of suck if the stuff that's in here isn't in here. Um, but they're, no, we're getting there. Awesome company, so that wouldn't be the case. So this should be two 8x10s. Now, normally... When I do eight by tens, I do some degree of uh, I do some degree of like, oh no, what is it? What is it? But I know what they are, so I'm not gonna do it now. They put them both in the same holder. Mythics or Dendics, I love you, but I would have liked the other holder too. But that's okay. Um, we have Shelly Duvall. You know, nice piece from The Shining, obviously. Baseball bat. We know what happens on the stairs. And then we have, and this is Beckett, um, and then we have Scream, signed by Nev Campbell. You know, like, I need a Nev Campbell autograph, and I know this is going to sound strange. I didn't want just, like, one of the modeling shoots. You know, like, they had a lot of her in, like, various states of undress, and, like, yeah, okay, the, you know, it's cool. But as far as, like, I want something more connected to the movie, and... The, you know, it was either that or like Helen the phone. So I don't know. Somewhere along the lines that I'd like to get one of maybe Helen the cape or Helen the costume, like when she put it on, and then maybe I'll trade that one out. So those are those two. And then we have this box, which comes from Monster Mania. Because unbeknownst to me, well, maybe you all, you know, you all know, but unbeknownst to me, um, Monster Mania opened up their own little shop. And I was on it. And the prices, relative to other prices, actually really good. Now, granted, I only got 8 by 10s here. So, you know, if you want a, a good tip for those of you collecting autographs, you know, if, you, if you're willing to stay with the 8 by 10s like if you're not... One, 8 by 10s are good, too, because I have a lot of 11 by 14 16 by 20s 12 by 18s and you get all excited with them, and then you start realizing, oh, shit, where's the wall space? So 8 by 10s are not only economical, but they're space-saving, so I tend to hang with that more now, unless I can find a nice, um, unless I can find a nice, um, collaborative piece, like a multi-signature on it. So, and we have several autographs, several in here. And Monster Mania, or you say Mint Authentics, Monster Mania went up to you, because they did have, they did include, uh, individual cases for everything, but I, I kid. I actually have gotten a lot of stuff from Mint Dicks Authentic in the past, and I'm planning on getting the Macabre box, which goes on sale the 25th, which will have just three photos in it. So not props this time, but that's I like that. So here's what we got. We got a bunch of... We got one, two, three, four, five. Five autographs, all certified by Monster Mania, okay, which is very, very neat. Um, the first one, and I was looking around for a, um, a piece like this, and everywhere I found, they only had the bigger ones, and the bigger ones were a little too pricey, then I wanted to pay for this trio. But I picked up the Brer Witch, signed by the three main cast. And admittedly, the only name that pops out at me is Heather Donahue, um, but you have Heather Donahue, the one guy, and then you have the guy in the corner. But either way, it's kind of neat. I was a fan of Brer Witch Project. It's not... I don't know. I know some people idolize it. I don't do that with it. I actually think Rats Broadcast got a raw deal. Because, you know, like everyone thinks they stole off it, but that's all different thing. But it's so cool to have. A Scream Queen. An absolute Scream Queen. Been in a bunch of things. She was even in a VH1 reality series called Scream Queens. Um, and let's not forget her in Summer School. That would, that would be awesome, too, to get a photo of her from that. But we got, well, I got, I think we can't really have it, but Miss Shawnee Smith. 
Now, she signed across the reverse bear trap, which ideally you would hope they use the lighter marker for, but it's still dark enough where you can see it see it pretty well. And, like, that's such an iconic scene um, throughout the movie series. You know, you see that a couple of times. Um, Fondacaro, Phil Fondacaro, Troll. Who doesn't love Troll? Obviously, he's in a few other things, too. But this is just one of those things. I don't want to say, I'm not going to make a joke like, well, I'm correcting, so now I have this and Walk Davis. I only need a couple more. Just, this was such a fun movie for me when I was young. Um, and no, I'm not a big fan of uh, the sequel. Although, was he in the sequel too? I don't know. Um, two more. And because I got this one, I had to freaking reget. I sold my shock of the snake to dummy. And I had to reget it because I wanted to spray it with this. We have the man himself. And not only is he Shaka, he is um, X-File fans, you know, and he's also the grandfather on uh, Supernatural. So, very neat there. And last, but not least, and again, this was one I was in between on, but the price was low enough, and she did such a phenomenal freaking job in this movie. Some hush. Where's the autograph? Am I hiding the autograph from you? No, you see it. It's on, it's on the mask. So, Maddie. Now, this is neat for me again. All eight, all seven, by all eight by tens. You know, uh, plus eight by tens. Oh, another thing, another reason to try to go with eight by tens, folks, is eight by tens. If you go to somewhere like Michaels, uh, you can get nice, nice uh, frames. Usually two for one or fifty percent off. Same thing. Um, or if you want to get a cheaper frame, like, it still has the white plastic where it's not going to stick to it, you can do that too, with somewhere else. You probably get frames for like two bucks from some places. So, easier to spray that way, easier to mount. But, thanks for checking out my video. I'm going to try to get some more up here and there. Like I said, little things come in. Um, I haven't been, I've had more stuff going out at times, right, even than coming in. Although, I do have some miscellaneous boxes here and there. Um, you know, but... Again, as always, I will have a contest. I keep saying this when I hit 500. It'll happen eventually, you know, so slow and steady wins the race. But it'll be a fun one because I want to have a giveaway that, one, you like, and I also want to have a giveaway that helps me clear out some stuff. Who knows? Some of the stuff you see on the walls behind you could be included. I do have multiple screen masks. Anyway, have a good one, everybody. Peace.